What's up guys, welcome to Supercars of London. I have literally just put the camera down, or Zach has just put the camera down from filming the Pokemon Go video. And because we're in Knightsbridge, that our end point from the Pokemon Go video, we are now gonna spend the evening here, supercar spotting, seeing what is going on every year. The heat just keeps on getting turned up. The supercars are hated even more by the residents. And to be honest, not a lot are making that much noise. So we are gonna just go and have a look around, see what is going on. Hopefully there are some new arrivals and I'm just gonna vlog the entire evening, potentially meet up with a few friends and just see what is going on. But first thing, I've been in this t-shirt all day and it's 33 degrees today. So I'm gonna change my t-shirt and also put on some actual shoes um, so that I'm not getting blisters and stuff like that because we're gonna cover some miles tonight. Zach's still playing Pokemon. There's some there's some right good talent around here. <laughs> some talent. You missed two event stores around the corner where you were playing Pokemon. Really? Yeah, I forgot to tell you about that. Where, the Jamira? Yeah. Damn. Let's go and check out. What is it? What cars are they? Uh, uh, Ventival, SV, and a DMC Eventsor. Sick. Well, let's go and check them out. And there's a 458 just over there. Spider. Oh, yeah, yeah. We drove past that on the way in. I didn't miss that one, but Aventadors. Let's go and check these out. Just seen the uh, Aventadors over here. Great, it was a 570. What is that? Yeah, good spot. What a spot. Here is the Red Beast. Now I'm gonna pop the boot and get my shoes and t-shirt. I bet this is boiling. Looks like, I, I thought it was chrome, but it's a silver F12. And we're coming up to Stone Street now. And it is open for parking. We've got a Rolls Royce there. There's a Bentayga as well, Abu Dhabi Rolls Royce. Yeah, this F12 is a, a London resident actually. It's a really nice one though. cars are parking. I've taken my uh, flip-flops off and we are going to head to Harrods. Silver one. You prefer the silver one? Silver one's a lot nicer. It's got silver wheels. Rule number one when it comes to supercars. What's black, rule number one? Black wheels. Black wheels. <laughs> <laughs> it's still cool. Daytona seats. Lambo. Oh, DMC. IP, oh, yeah, yeah. IP event store. That's cool. Oh, look at this.
it is still hot. It is still hot and we're walking around Harrods. Not too much is going on. There's a relatively big police presence on Sloan Street now. We are gonna go and grab some food because I'm so thirsty but also hungry. Um, and the Dodge, is it a Challenger? Or a Dodge Charger? A Challenger. Whatever it is, it is loud. Um, he's parking up at Harrods right here. And um, he's the only one that's been making some noise and luckily for him, he's been dodging the police pretty well. So uh, this is what's uh, been making the noise over there. That is really nice. This call I've ever seen. That was so close. We have just been walking, completely ignoring the fact that there is a brand new Maserati Levante. We walked past it. So that we went around to get some food. And we didn't even notice. What the hell? I didn't even know there was customer deliveries of these. No, it's the only one. Only one? It's the only one in the UK. There you go, only one in the UK. Well, that was a surprise. It turns out I started talking to the uh, Maserati employee, but that is the twin turbo V6 that isn't even gonna be available in the UK, although he was saying that the demand is so high that it potentially might be at some point in the future. But it was still pretty cool to see. Uh, first one that I've seen on the road, and he was saying it's the only one in the country, so not too bad. I need to post it up to Instagram, and we are on the hunt for that dark red. I think it's Rosso, Festo is the Lamborghini paint code. It sounds pretty geeky, but I'm not entirely too sure. Anyway, we are on the hunt to find it. I can see the front nose of the Aventador SV, so let's carry on trying to hunt some supercars. Someone's taking Pokemon Go seriously. This is all of the things that you cannot do as a supercar in London. No, don't do any of that. Hey, how are you? Good, how are you? Thank you. Thank you. Good morning guys, it is 9 o'clock in the morning of the following day. So last night we lost light pretty quickly and I met up with Tom, TGE and also his twin brother James or JE on Instagram and Twitter. And they came down in their Lamborghini and port. It was too dark to film, we had to catch up for about 20 minutes or so. And then I left London and I completely forgot to sign off. And then annoyingly I got back at about midnight and then woke up today a half past seven to get ready to leave so that I can head over to Guildford to meet up with Sam from See Through Glass 
this is the first time that he would have seen my new look and also heard the car for the first time. So I thought that I would continue the vlog over to the following day to try and capture some of his reactions of seeing and hearing my car for the first time. Oh my God, it's out of focus. <laughs> <laughs> I've bumped into Sam. Oh, don't tell me he's gonna have to reverse. Yep. <laughs> he probably hasn't heard my car yet <laughs> because I'm behind him. England. They still are, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. kind of, I think. Yeah. Most of it's made in England. Steve's asking where the Jaguar was made. So we're here, we've parked up, met up with Sam from See Through Glass and Steve Booker from hey. Steve Booker. It's <laughs> <laughs> always funny when people say, hey, uh, so what's your channel at, uh, Steve Booker? Yeah. <laughs> oh, so what was your name? Yeah. Steve. Steve. <laughs> do you want to hear my car? Yes, please. I've been waiting the whole time. I want to hear your car. Do you want to hold it and do, it do a reaction together? Okay. Like this? Do you have multiple angles? No. Also, we, I think there's people over here enjoying a pub lunch that are going to be oh, yeah. destroyed. <laughs> also, if the car sounds really bad, let's pretend like Of course, yeah, yeah, yeah. Woo! <laughs> Files on. No, that's it, comfortable. I thought so. Ready? Yeah. Drop to a <laughs> Oh, my oh, God. My it sounds angry. So yeah. It sounds like it's got too much power. <laughs> I know we were cruising on the motorway, but you never I had it in comfort mode, so you can really wow. hear it. That is mad. When when it gets the proper to the top end of the rev. It bangs down. Yeah. Yeah, it's crazy. But now we're gonna get kicked out of the car at all. So that was good fun to catch up with Sam and Steve and for them to hear the car for the first time. We had been cruising, you may have seen on Snapchat, we cruised for I'd say about 10-15 minutes before and I just kept it very, very, oh look, Ferrari, it's a Ferrari. Come on Zoom, be quicker than that. Anyway, the sun is out and I'm headed back and that is two days wrapped into one vlog. Hopefully you've enjoyed it a bit of, oh, green light ready. Hopefully you have enjoyed uh, what I've been getting up to and apologies in the delay, but yeah, I've been out pretty much all day today. Tomorrow I am down near Winchester and fingers crossed I can at least get the Pokemon Go video up. Thank you for watching guys. Please give it a thumbs up if you haven't already and subscribe and I will see you very, very soon on Supercars of London. Cheers guys.